sentiment is showing us that Tesla faces significant competition in the energy, by the way, tons of energy questions, energy storage side of the business. When you model out energy revenue, do your projections account for increasing competition in that space as infinite demand may be satisfied by other players? Hats off to you and the whole team. Lummox, I like the way you think. ABP, always be paranoid and always have your head around the corner seeing what's happening. But first of all, Tesla leads the pack in the, so not heating more, in the energy storage market. I don't know how that got in there. Uh, they have about 25% of the global battery energy storage uh, market. Then you have players like SunGrow, 14%, Cattle, 10%. And Fluence are getting traction as well. But the key, what people always say, you know, for years with Tesla is like, oh, the competition are coming. But remember, they have extreme excellence in efficiency, in volume, and the time it takes to spin up these energy storage things in their battery cells. Um, nobody, nobody can match that. Also, the fact that they're eating their own dog food, what we used to call dog fooding, with their own data centers, they figured out exactly how to smoothen out the electricity. And to make matters worse for the competition, Tesla doesn't stand still. They continue to iterate and make their products better. So the Mega Pack 3 was already the best storage solution in the market by far. Now they just launched the Mega Block, which is 23% faster to install, 40% lower construction costs, plug and play platform. 91% round trip efficiency, 20 megawatt hours of usable AC electricity, et cetera, runs in any temperature condition, will last for 25 years. Uh, nobody has this. <laughs> nobody. Now, Tesla as well, their true edge is software. Their software runs better than anybody else. They've got a thing called AutoBidder, which uses AI to predict market conditions and price accordingly, and it boosts ROI by 20 to 50%, of which Tesla also take a share of that from the utility. And they've got virtual power plants all over the world now, and they do over-the-air updates, and that's just rock solid. So will the competition come? Yeah. Will Tesla still sell every one that they make? Yeah. Will they still do it at very high margins, like 31.8% margins? Yeah. Will they continue to reiterate and make it better? Yep. So don't worry about the competition. Plus, the demand for this thing is through the roof because the simple little chart we tried to put together around what these things do, it smoothens the power spikes. If you have GPUs that cost billions, they can't take a power spike or else you blow them up. And then you lose billions. And this is why it's so critical, even across milliseconds, to ensure grid stability and continuous AI operations. And no big flux spikes which can destroy everything this is where they have the edge